Yeah, so first, right click on your desktop. If you are using the old, the latest Windows 10 or Windows 11, just right click on your desktop like I did now, then click on display settings. When you click on display settings, scroll down to graphics. When you are on graphics, then you will need to click on browse so when you click on browse you will need to check the the folder in which the uh, photoshop icon is in so i have my photoshop icon on my desktop so i'm just going to click on desktop then find the photoshop icon so here is it i'm just going to click on add so when you click on add then what you will need to do is that you will find the photoshop here click on it click on options then select here select high performance so when you select high performance just click on save so when you set in on high performance run it as administrator when you do this the photoshop will run using your graphics card so if the first step does not work then here is the second step right click on this pc go to properties when you are on properties check on find device manager here is mine i'm going to click on here so before doing this make sure you connect your pc to any internet connection that it's available for you to use so when you connect your phone to an internet connection you're going to click on display adapters so when you click on display adapters it, it will show you all the graphics card that are available on your laptop or pc but for mine i just have intel hd 520 so what you will need to do is to right click click on update then search automatically for drivers so you're just going to click on here so the windows will search the latest drivers that uh, is available for your graphic card the windows will search the latest drivers that is available for your graphics card so if it shows that the device the latest graphic card graphic driver is already installed on your pc so what you will need to do is that i will need you to confirm that with this program called driver booster I have used the driver booster programs to update many graphics card drive, graphic drivers because when I come here sometimes on device manager and try updating a driver here for example this one as you can see my graphics card on the device manager is showing that my graphic drivers on the device manager is showing that it's up to date but when I use the driver booster it will do deep scanning then search the latest version of the drivers of your graphic drivers that is not available on the on the device manager just hold on so after the drivers after the driver booster finish scanning scanning all the, it will display all your drivers and display the drivers that are up to date as you can see you can see how many drivers the driver booster is displaying this is something that the device manager cannot do so let's check for example let me find my graphics card here to confirm if it's up to date you see here is my graphic card and it's not up to date but when you check in on the device manage, manager try to upload it here it will show that it's up to date so what i'm going to do is now now is that what you will need to do so i'm not going to do, update it anymore because i already solved mine but what you will need to do you are just going to click on update and you click on update click on ok so i'm just going to stop it so when you click on ok then it will download the graphic drivers then install it automatically so when it's done done install make sure you restart your pc so hopefully everything will be okay so everything will be okay so but if you are using if your graphic card is nvidia and you haven't succeeded using these two methods then i have a video i will put a, vi a video in the end of this video that will show you how to solve this same problem so if the driver booster update does not work for you or the first method that i showed you does not work for you then 
it might be because your graphic card is um, nvidia so if your graphic card is nvidia then i'm going to put a video in the end of this video that will show you how to solve that problem the video is made for nvidia graphics so i think with that video if you watch that video uh, it will show you you will know how you can set up your photoshop to run using your nvidia graphics so make sure you subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification bell so that you will get notified anytime that i upload a tutorial video so see you in my next video and make sure you give this video a thumbs up comment if you are facing any difficulties in doing this so that i will try my best to help you